Oops. We don't want that. We don't want that. Hey, what's up, guys? Back at it again. Welcome to the Jedi Jet Show. I'm Jedi Jet. What's up, you guys? Akito Hall. What's up? Welcome to the Jedi Jet Show. We are drawing again, picking up from where we left off, kind of. Got like, some explaining to do to you guys. I have to explain it. I can explain. I can explain what happened last time. Uh, we're listening to Epidemic Sounds. We got some K-pop tracks on there. It's all licensed music that I paid for. So, kind of some decent music on YouTube. This one's called Cali Love by Adelaide. 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 Adeline. Adeline Pike. A lot of Adeline Pike. Guys. Thank you, Adeline Pike, for such smooth smooth jams for these YouTube's live streams because we all know YouTube does not like copyrighted music especially for live streaming yeah I mean it. hi 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 hello um, please pull up a seat and a sketch pad iPad drawing tablet poster board whiteboard um canvas notebook and sketch with me please or just sit back and just relax and we'll just draw together okay all right Let's see where this is gonna go because last time we left last time last time I told you that I'd be on Twitch, and then I first off, first off, let me explain. I want to go. I want to go eat. Okay, I can explain myself. Promise. No, I can't. I can't explain myself. <laughs> Just kidding. Again. So what I did was I went to go eat, and then um. After that, I, I tried to set up my uh, my my camera because I wanted to do camera on the, on Twitch. Um. And for some reason, the light, the, the color and stuff was off, and I was confused. And then spent about an hour and a half doing that, and it was so hot yesterday. Um, and I was just like, you know, when you're like in the zone, you don't want to go get up and turn on the AC or anything. You just, you just keep doing what you're doing. You're like, let me just finish this because it shouldn't take too long. Let me just calibrate these colors, um, the, the lighting, so it's not like weird and grainy and stuff, because. I like drawing in slightly dim lit room. Um, but with the camera, it doesn't look good. So I wanted to try to make it look nice. And it took me an hour and a half. And I was like, crap, I'm just sweating here in the heat. <laughs> and then at that point, it was late. I still was ready to go and stream. But I was like, let me just lay down for a quick second. And I was like, 9 p.m. Wasn't that late? I laid down and I did not get up. And I was so tired. So that that's what the heat does to you. You just like zaps. Zaps it. Let me know you guys if you guys can hear me, okay? Thank you so much for joining. We're drawing uh Final Fantasy 7 classic characters. Classic character lineup. I'm trying to get ready for Anime Expo 2022. Wow, can't believe it. My first ever show was Anime Expo in 2000, 2016 with Ross Draws and Cynics design and we were just like boas, we were just little boas, well we weren't little boys. Well, it was our first convention ever together. So we're trying to, um, well I'm trying to finish these first couple pieces. Hey Finke, welcome, welcome from Brazil, glad you can make it. What time is it right now in Brazil? Like similar time zone, I guess. It's like ish. 
All right. So we have this light source here emanating from. It may be a little too loud, huh? Let me turn this. I don't like. Pretty, pretty song. Let me just turn you down real quick. Yeah. Yeah. So we're just, we're just vibing right now. Just, just vibing together. Actually, I took a nap today too. So like, I woke up way early. I wake up really early. My sleep is all crazy. You guys don't know. I have a weird sleep schedule. Very weird. It's crazy. I wake up like 2 a.m. in the middle of the night, 3 a.m. And um, end up like falling asleep like afternoon, being really sleepy, and then go to sleep, and then and then take a nap for like four hours in the middle of the day what can what size canvas uh, it's, um, this is a 13 wait this is a 13 by 23 inch ju just because it's gonna be final but um 20 uh, 13 by 19 so it's gonna be cropped like around clouds knees right here it's gonna be cropped around there but I wanted to extend it just to uh, get a feel for uh, the length of the legs and stuff to make sense of like where their knees and stuff end and start and etc. This is no no no. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. This line is really, 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 really straight. I don't like that. We're gonna try to do something about that. What are we gonna do? Huh. Multiply? There's still a little line here. What is this? Ah, got it. Got it. Got it. Okay. We gotta start strong, okay? Cause I'm gonna start I'm gonna start murmuring again cause mumbling cause I've been drawing actually for the past couple hours. And so I'm already in like that stage of my brain where I'm just like, oh, focus, 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 focus. So if I'm mumbling, please let me know. I'll turn up, I'll turn up a little bit. I'll turn up. Mm -hmm. So we have light emanating from the flowers. And then we're going to go over here and try to bring out the lights. By the top. Oh, oh, oh! We're on the same layer. Yeah, we don't want that. Yeah, we don't want that. Okay, that's the one. All right. Let's change the color so we can make sure we don't confuse it. The, another color. Mm. Yeah. Something like that. So, if you guys are not familiar with like Final Fantasy artwork, um, this is kind of homage to this style. I, I was actually initially trying to do more Krenzy style. If you guys know some of Krenz's work, Krenz Kush art, um, some of his old pieces, very old pieces, used to do something with a tinting technique. Not really tinting, I don't think he tints. I don't know, I actually know what process he uses. But I would assume that I would use a tinting process. But the more I look at. Um, the more I more paint, I, I kind of follow more along the lines of like um, Yoshitaka, I think Yoshitaka. I don't know, no, 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 Aki Akihiko Yoshida, Aki Akihiko Yoshida. Uh, both artists, uh, Yoshitaka Mano and, and Akihiko Yoshida, are incredible artists. Um, I don't know. I don't know much about them. 
and I tend to be, um, I collect, I collect art just like, kind of like, um, kind of like a crazy person, let's just say. Uh, I like this song, but I want to have something a little more, a little more sexy, a little more, just a little more vibey, you know what I mean? That's a little, a little more hip hoppy. Uh, hey, what's up, guys? Yami, are you drawing on a secret tablet or? A screen tablet or on a drawing tablet? Uh, screen tablet. Yoshi, Yoshi Takamano? Yeah, is that one of the artists we see? Yoshi. Or is it something else? Yoshi Takamano. No, 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 not Yoshi Takamano. No, no, no. Akihiko Yoshida. Aki. Hiko, Aki. Yoshida. So, yeah, Agiho Yoshida. That's the one. That's the one, you guys. They're both Final Fantasy like square, square artists, and they're like legends. They like, you know, what I mean, they're like those powerhouses that have been with them throughout like years and like decades from the beginning, and they just constantly improve. And they're like the signature look of Final Fantasy and. You know, at this at this stage, concept art and all this stuff means nothing to them. They're just like, just let them do what they do. Just make it, just make it nice. Where? I'm gonna lose this YouTube uh, live stream link. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I need someone drawing tutorials for slow people. I just can't get the hang of it. For slow people. You're talking to a slow person right now. Very slow. Very slow. It it takes a while, okay? I'm an old I'm an old man, okay? It's not like it's not like it just happens. See how much light. Let's just keep, let's just emerge this light here. Just hit the tops of these forms. Maybe there's like a little a little uh, horizon, uh, sunset on horizon. It's hitting the top of their heads, like uh, just the top, just the top, just the top. This doesn't make any sense. It goes up here. Ah, girl, you cold blooded. Girl, you cold blooded. See, this is one on my, on my own playlist, like my own songs, because I've already curated them. Mm. Yeah, I wonder what's from the older FF games. I think. Yeah. No, he's he's still around. I'm sure he still does stuff for them. And then there's um there's one more like for like the um can someone look it up for me the uh, artist for like uh, Final Fantasy X and a lot of that like uh, I think um, Kingdom Hearts has uh, he's got like very prolific artist from like the 90s or late 2000s or something yeah so i've already like mellowed out just quite a bit so nothing crazy today nothing too crazy unless i take some like get some drink some coffee it's already late. Are there any good tutorials tracing tutorials? I'd like to tr I'd like to trace Daz 3D renderings, but not make it look traced. Oh, you want to trace stuff without making it look traced? 
Hmm. What do you mean? <laughs> if it's traced, it's gonna look traced. It's gonna look traced. Okay. Let's get it. Let's get it right. Maybe you can do it. But I have a whole a whole lecture and breakdown on why why traced objects or traced images is is always gonna look traced because it is derivative of another idea. It's not an original. When you are painting and creating, you want to have things that are original ideas, original original thought. And when you do something that's original, it it means it means you're creating something new. You're putting some some new idea onto the canvas. Um, you're laying it down for the first time, so it's going to have this organic, natural feel to it. So that's why when you see inked art from like a really sketched, uh, really loose sketch rough draft, when you ink it, a tendency is to lose its energy. So it, you like zap it a little bit because it's, it goes from loose and it captures all this like um, spontaneous, natural like lines and rhythm. And when you, um, when you, when you, when you, uh, ink it you're essentially tracing it unless you're like a master right you you look at these rough drafts and um you can make you can be inspired from the uh, rough draft in order to create those new lines so it's really hard to cap to make something not look traced if you're tracing so especially if something's already done so which is what it is right so if something's 3d it's done it's complete so when you do a tracing of it you're not really adding anything to it. Whereas if it's a rough line, like these are rough lines and I were to go over them again with another line, um, like for example, like these, these eyes or this hair right here, right? I'm just gonna do it. So if I were to do some lines for it, it's not like I'm gonna go over these lines exactly the same way. That's gonna rob the life from those lines. What you need to do is constantly innovate and build on it. So you're doing it as a guide. You're not doing it to to like trace. So like these eyelashes, they're there as a guide. So I look at it and I, and I play with it like this. You know, you kind of go around it. Um, you know, and then the more you go over it again and again, the more it loses its, its energy again. So, um, that's a problem with inking. So, um, yeah, there are methods in order to keep the life. It's always change the the stage that you're working with. So instead of just like going from rough to inks, first put values and stuff down on top of the uh, the objects, and then and then ink on top of that. So Instead of hitting it directly from rough lines to clean lines, put some values down. When you lay some values down, like these these lines are so, so, so rough. But when I added these values all in there, it started to build up the forms. And from that, then I ink it. If I were to ink it, I would use these this information as, as opposed to using the rough draft lines. So you're you're not going from rough to tracing. So you just, it's like you can't double up on the same idea, otherwise you lose the life. And that's, yeah, that's where, it's my, it's my two cents anyway. Uh, yo, what's up? What's up, Magic Rain? Will you be selling this poster? Possibly, if I can finish it in time. If I can finish it in time, I gotta. All right, and if you do need a license. Hmm. Do you need license? Um. Officially, yes. Technically, yes. But when you're doing like fan art, you kind of just hope that they don't they don't flag you for it or hit you up for it. I mean, you can always do that. Um, Japanese companies are tend to be a little more lenient on it. With fan art, doujinshi, they kind of encourage it at times too. It's the uh, bigger companies like Ghibli or. Um, which was like bought up by Disney, I believe. So anything like 
that's Western, like Disney and stuff, Marvel, that's when you run into real problems. They will shut you down like from small people at a convention. They just, no. Um, the best way to do fan art is to make it more um, your own. Like you have to make it change, like you have to modify it enough to the point where it's like, resembling the original but not completely like it so um think of like sakimi chan or or um uh, a few other artists i can't think of them off the top of my head but sakimi chan is a really good example of that she modifies the character enough to be it becomes um, her own so when you, when it becomes like your own it's like you can make the argument that hey this is not really that character this character has blue pants with like these earrings instead and this stuff and that and stuff. so it's like you know but when you're doing it like to the t then it's like you're representing that company at that point and you're like like look at it if you were to create something right you created a character and it became pretty popular right you're just like a small no time no like small timer race no timer <laughs> small um amateur and you got popular enough with the internet and then everybody starts drawing it and making money off of it let's say that's a good thing fine but what if somebody like takes that character and you okay and you don't make much off of your character but somebody else takes it and they make millions from your character this is just a hypothetical how would that make you feel obviously it's the other way around like disney and all them they're they're already making the millions and we're we're the we're the small timers who are like you know like capitalizing on it um but the principle stays the same it's still the same concept like you you're taking something that's not yours and you're profiting off of it um yeah so legally you're not really allowed to um do any fan art really um but it's always like uh implied consent so if the i'm not a lawyer i gotta put that out there i ain't no lawyer obviously i'm done like my dummy okay um so don't take this like what i'm about to say is like is as fact but the common consensus is that when they express um, their express their uh, consent, some sort of consent, verbal consent, like publicly, that kind of makes it a more lenient or binding, like or more lenient. Uh, uh, it gives a little bit more permission to do the the, the fan art because they say like. Yeah, do my characters, all my characters, do my do my characters. My company allows it. We we want we want artists to do fan art of our character. Then if they say that like publicly, then it's on public record that they consented to it. So it would be like a case against them in court. Be like, hey, but you said it was okay. What's so what's that? What's up with that? So it's kind of um, it can be. Uh, a legal case anyways let's move on it's boring first time catching stream. hey what's up magic rain talk to you at anime we can only hey what really that's so cool yeah it's it's so cool how i can meet you here after the shows before it was weird to see like people at the shows who say they've seen my new show so now since i'm doing like a bunch of shows it's the other way like sir you guys are like dropping into the show. It's cool. It's cool, man. That's cool. Thank you. Man. Boom. That's oh, right. Adeline Pike again. Adeline Pike. We'll, we'll, we'll be there. We'll be there. We'll be there. We will be. And I'll see you there. And, uh, thank you. I'm, uh, table I7. 
I7. Row, row I7. It's a pretty, pretty good spot. Look, a little history on Anime Expo. The biggest, the biggest show in all of California or all of the United States. It broke all the records, beat out uh, Comic Con, um, San Diego, which was like they held the little, held the record for the longest time, and I think in 2019 it broke the record for most attendance attendees, like 450,000 people at the show. It's huge. Um, and. Uh, Crazy thing is, is they allow so many artists in to the show. It's it's bloodbath. The way they used to do it, and I think they still do. I don't actually don't know, but they, they should change it um, a little bit. Maybe not. Maybe maybe not. Um, it's kind of nice. It's kind of nice. I'll explain it. So the way they accept applications is different from other ones. It's first come first serve. So once the 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 application is open everybody floods the gates they flood it and i shouldn't even be saying this otherwise you guys are all gonna flood it too but the day that it opens up everybody just floods the machine and like tens of thousands of artists from around the world are like trying to get a spot and there are seven i think about 700 spots maybe 700 i might be wrong could be 400 which is a lot of a lot of people for a single show like it's the most i think the second most is like 400 something like that average that i go to like 200 artists or something like that but with so many artists you would imagine you would you would expect it to be like the um, the um, you would expect the uh the, well i'm trying to say is you would affect it you expect it to affect your sales and have lower traffic or you know, less less to go around but that's really not the case for a lot of people um, I've heard people who, who struggle too um, um, but it, it comes down to also skill and what you bring so it's not just like just because you're in you're gonna make a ton of money but for the most part it is true that show um, there's just a lot of it's just so many people so, so there's just so much people you have um, a lot more traffic, a lot more people to um, to buy art. Um, oh, I'm trying to get it. It's just really, really busy, really crazy and hectic. And oh, I don't like this song. Yeah, let's just. Alright. Alright, knock out some character designs. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it together. Let's do it together. Character designs. Yeah, and, and Animex was also the most expensive show as well. Uh, for attendees. I think. What? Am I wrong there? No. That's wrong. That's wrong. That's wrong. Mm, if I could just play my own music, I just play my own music, but I can't. I want to. Want to? Uh, oh, oh, this song again. <laughs> uh, if I could just like randomize, is there a randomize? No, there isn't. It's just you just go down the. Doesn't work that way. It's just going down the list. Come on, man. Come on. Come on, bro. Yeah, I 
Impressive as usual. Can we know which graphic tablet to use? It's a uh, 12, 12 inch Wacom Cintiq. Wacom Cintiq 12 inch. Yes. We got a lighting here. And should we have a lighting on the right side too? Hmm. I get some warm lights on the left, which is kind of cool. Now if I hit it the, on the right as well, I don't know if that'll make sense. Hmm. Um, no, I don't think I'll do that. I might do some other lighting, like a subtle bluish tone. But we have this light here, and then we have this light here. And if we do it here as well, it might feel a little overdone. Let's look at some more examples. So yeah, I said I'd do Twitch last time because I wanted to listen to my own music, and then I ended up not going. <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. If you guys are waiting for me there, I'm just like, I passed out. I got tired, I was like, screw this. Screw this. This camera's freaking stupid. Boy, he didn't fall in love. Uh, can we know which, uh, do you have any favorite Final Fantasy games? Ah, my favorite, my all-time favorite is, um, Seven, the remake, because that's the only one I've ever played. I mean, I've played, <laughs> played like eight, ten, um, but I've never finished it. Nine, just never finished it. But I finished. Uh, uh, that's me. I get ADHD. Okay, I get stuck. They have these stupid mini games, which I get stuck on, and then I end up playing that, and then I forget about the game, and so I play it for so long. The mini games that I go. Uh, I should start over because I don't know what's going on anymore. I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. So I like, and then I never pick it back up. It messes me up. Don't put those in there. I will get distracted. Don't put them in there. What you doing, square? I'm always blown away by your colors and lighting so good. Uh, yeah. Working on it. Um, it's just one at a time. One at a time. I'm just trying to sh carve out some of these shapes so we know what they are. So if, if it's a form that's being buried in like debris if you put a little light on it you will be able to like make sense of it a little better that form is like oh yeah uh, so it's like makes a little sense i like the song and i think i like the last one too called waiting for love yeah let me put this on my list so that i can come back to it when i want to listen to it again yeah, I, I'm like a music fiend, and I collect like thousands, tens of thousands of songs, and I, I rank them all, rank them all. So it's like they're all ready to go, but I can't listen to them. Mm. 
Let's go this way. is like really tired otherwise I'd be singing a lot more and making noises with the song oh by the way by the way I've got to tell you guys from yesterday you know the song that I was singing it demonetized my whole entire video just like I said it's a cover of a Chinese song and it still was picked up I was like uh, rip rip and I uh so, no more singing on, uh, on YouTube. That's what happens. Like, the whole entire, all the views that I get, yep, they, they claimed it. Like, it, it goes to the, uh, it goes to the, uh, the video's revenue. It all goes to the original content owner. It wasn't, like, flagged or anything. It's just, they just take the, uh, the monetization of your video. It wasn't, um, I didn't get a strike is what I'm saying. So I think that's a great, that's actually a really great model for um, musicians. Like, instead of like striking down a, a video, making them take it down and all this stuff, they just handle it that way. It's like they now own copyright to your video and not copyright, but um, the revenue that comes from your video. So if you're like posting like music, like say for example, you post uh, music of someone you, of your, um, your artist, your musician. I believe they should. They should have the. They should earn the, the revenue from your videos views, because musicians, especially indie musicians, don't make enough money already. So, if you are spreading it out, you know, quote unquote, like pirating it, like you're stealing it. Like you shouldn't get the. You shouldn't get the, uh, the revenue from that. Um, if your sole if your sole purpose for posting the song was to post a song, not not as a backup anyway. Like say, I'm gonna repost this Justin Bieber song. I'm just gonna repost it. I'm not doing a stream or anything. It's literally just the song with lyrics or something. Then that oh, that should go to the person. Um, it gets a little complicated when you're not doing it just for the song. You're also streaming a show they don't they shouldn't own i think it mentioned that they don't they get a portion of the the revenue i don't know how it works but say if you put a whole production a show on and you're using their music well you don't have the right to use their music that's not your it's not your music unless you have it licensed so um but they shouldn't i don't think they shouldn't I like this song they shouldn't uh, take ownership of ownership of your whole entire video revenue videos revenue because of that all right moving on that's boring uh, what song is this which one this one down down da 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 oh yeah ice cream oh that's a of an inappropriate song let's say i mean i'm just saying i don't know i don't maybe i don't speak korean so but i know some words i know ice cream and i know chorong chum chorong you and i boy down down it's nice Magic Rain, the one before this one. Oh, I see. The one before this one. The uh, left, no, the la last one was was uh, left in the rain. I'm glad you're enjoying the music. That's what I'm talking about. We vibing, just vibing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm getting too too caught up in these small details. I gotta look, pull back. Pull back and just hit it like with a little bit larger brush and more generalization. Just tap it 
Let's have it catch some of that form, catch some of those shapes. And come back and refine it later. So what's this? What is this? Thumb? No thumb? He doesn't have a thumb. Should have a thumb, but it doesn't. That's what happens. Down, down, da 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 should I hit all that in my... If I do all that, it's gonna be too much. Oh. Let's try this thicker shape here so when we introduce thicker shapes we slowly introduce it into other other planes and other shapes and see how much the surface area can span across but we start off with just a, a hair like a, a silver lining in this case an orange lining and then we slowly pull it more towards the right um, but I'm not teaching today. I'm not. Just, I'm just talking, okay? Just talking. By the way, his hair is very dark, and it wouldn't reflect so much. This side right here is catching some of the light from the, from this source here, so I'm gonna erase. It out this way. Uh, sound like a bop. <laughs> sound like a bop, you know what I'm saying? I know what you mean. Bop. Bop skeezer. So I hadn't I didn't do clean inks for this, but as you can see, because the lights are the lights and shadows kind of there's not really many shadows but the lights um are helping to define a lot of the shapes damn it i'm talking again about art uh, uh. the lights are defining a lot of the sh shapes so even though the lines are super rough you can still make sense of a lot of those um it starts to come out it comes to come alive now we got that area here I think we should slow it down a bit not continue it down any further Ooh. otherwise we'll lose its intensity Yeah, I don't, you know, the style that I'm doing, it's, um, 
happens very organically, let's just say. Like, I'm not intentionally trying to do this style. I'm not trying to do a style. Uh, I'm just doing it. And each step lends itself to the next. There's, a, there's a, like a million different styles, quote unquote. And uh, I didn't actually want to do it this way. But it just happened. I'm just like, okay. Okay. I could have inked it. Do like a Hyung Tae Kim style where all the lines are actually refined and rendered. And then just put in some flats and shapes and stuff. That's one technique. Another sh technique is I could have blocked in all of the shapes using... Sorry, blocked in all the colors and forms using sh um, flat shapes. And that comes out looking really nice as well. Um, I really like that technique as well. Um, this is more of a looser style where you can build up the forms and shapes. And so I think it works well because it's faster. And I think that's why, what, uh, yeah, that's definitely what, um, uh, reason why I did it this way anyway it's because I knew I'm, I'm short on time I'm very short on time I initially wanted to do like 20 pieces I'm telling people hey I'm gonna do like 20 pieces I'm gonna I'm gonna, gonna discontinue like 20 pieces and then bring all these new drawings to the show don't worry nope 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 nope, nope, nope. but I am about to do like three or four so hopefully I can do four if I can do five it'd be so amazing um, cause I already have about 60, I already have like 65 or something and I don't want to bring like the same ones again and again. Um, even though it's been like three years since my last anime, since the last anime expo, um, I think I've made maybe a good, a good 10 or 15 new drawings. Any artists I recommend? Um, I recommend... Uh, Man, off the top of my head. <laughs> Not really. Not really. Um, but A Akihiko Akihiko Yoshida. For sure. Um Hyung Take Him. Just depends on your style or your preferences. Hair comes out this way. Can it can it catch light? No, I don't think so. Um, I figure this form here for his nose. I'm not sure if that's gonna catch like that. If the plane is here, uh -huh. that would mean the rounded part of his nose would be here. Or not rounded bridge would be there. And there. And then. He wouldn't have like such a strong bridge uh, brow, so it would have to be. This whole entire plane would be in light. Then we can bring it down here. But his cheek is like way out there because I made it like anime, very anime esque. So. Song. 
Is that the same singer? He also s reminds me of like Kim Bumso. I forget it's like Kim Bumso. My favorites. One of my favorites in Korean singers. Sephiroth is like a super, super, super good looking dude. So we gotta make sure he's extra good looking. Any artists you recommend? Same question. Here, up a little close like this. Not too much, huh? Is that that much light on his face? Too much? Is it too much? Is it too much? Is it too much? Too much. Too much. Maybe too much. Too much cheek, definitely. Mm. So we'll have to uh, shave it down a bit. Or. Seems a little too angry though. I don't get that. Well, he is. He is like angry. He's always giving me headaches. So just running around giving people headaches. So let's uh let's soften up and run around. So. Whatever, it's a little flattened, flattened face, but it's fine. Cuts, cut, cut uh, did you just retract? Did you just retract your message? Did you just retract it? Did you just? Did you just retract your message? It's okay. I understand. I understand. Oh, one to one hundred. How how done are you? Good question. Um. I'd say 60% maybe. Um, good question, yeah. I don't know, I really can't gauge it because I have a lot more stages to do. I want to do like, I can either I can either go over it with like inks, which will flatten the drawing. I can go in with ambient occlusions to flesh out some of the shapes, but then I also got to add color. So there's no color. Um, do. Da, 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 da. So those three, and then um, then the background probably is gonna do like a simple like smoky texture of some sort. Keep it like focused on the characters. Um, yeah. Uh, this hair—he's got like weird hair. He needs to go like this. Mm 
Auto saving, okay. Sounds pretty. <laughs> this is Adeline Pike, girl. You're awesome. You know. I feel like I've been going a little crazy these couple of years. Two years and I lost myself a little bit. But and then I gotta lose myself a little bit to be found, I think. And find myself and learn and grow. Um, some rough, some hard times. I mean everybody's going through some difficult times. I, mean, I can't complain too much, but it's like definitely lost track of what I need to do in my life. I think just a bit. Like I know I say this all the time, like oh, I'm just gonna like disappear from YouTube and stuff, and but it's serious. Like I I leave like so long, like six seven months regularly, like and then I disappear and I come back. I remember when I used to do this every day with the group and the friends and. Um, now, like, I skip my, my Patreons, you know what I mean? I don't even put out Patreon rewards. I I've already skipped out six, six months or so this year. Skipped six months last year. I did, like, two or three Patreon rewards and then disappear again, you know? It's just, uh, I feel like I, I let myself down a lot. A lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. And when I say I'm a lazy bum, I'm not, I'm not even like exaggerating. I'm really, 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 really freaking lazy. And I think it's a lot to do with complacency. When I, f when I feel like I've like succeeded to an extent or a level, I'm just, I'm good. I just coast and not really push anymore. So it's a very scary pitfall trap. And then I think during COVID, I just really let myself go, like, completely, you know. Um, so I'm still trying to learn how to get back on track right now. Get my life back to where I want it to be. And stop playing around. You know, I've played around enough, but I think it's time I really get things together this year at, at the end of this year for sure i mean I'm, I'm always i'm always working and doing things but it's not enough like if if i were to give you exactly not even an exaggeration of how much work i put out to what i think i can i'm working at like five percent capacity so five percent potential five percent that's it that's all i do and I just keep getting older and older, and it's like, you shouldn't do that. Like, I don't know how to find balance. So, hopefully, this year I can do it. 
after this year, I mean. My biggest problem is sleep, I think. Sleep is like, if, ever, if, if I can sleep early, which I've actually been doing for the past couple weeks, or well, a couple weeks, um, past two, three weeks, because I'm preparing for shows again. Um, but if, if I can just sleep on time and not stay up so late, it would solve a lot of problems because I'm very productive in the morning or in the day and um, no, that light doesn't go there I turned off the other light I might turn the light what happened to the light see I'm starting to light, light parts of the drawing that should be lit which is kind of cool I gotta I should do that here now I know what I have lit without the other distracting light I think when I get things in order, I think like I can still ease up and pl and play a little bit here and there, but not like before, like very light, like casual, like, casual, like like literally like once every couple months. Because when I, I'm very extreme. I'm I'm extreme and polarized. I don't have balance. I have no chill. Like when I do things, it's over extreme. And it can be work related as well, not just like playing related. It's like if I do something work related, I'm in like all the way. Um, so that's another thing. Like I said, this is why I talked about limits yesterday. I needed to talk about that. Limits are important for me, especially because um, I get tunnel vision, and that's part of the, like I said, pre pre disposition I have it's not just ADHD it's, it's, um, I've learned about it. I haven't been diagnosed actually but it's pretty obvious um, but one second Hello, 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 hello. Uh, well, Jen, have you done anything for you? I feel like your channel has always been informative and your patrons as well. But when the last time you did something for me? Something for me? Um, I do it too often. <laughs> In terms of just like, me? You mean like you mean putting putting content out for people? See, that's the thing. It appears I think because it's a collection of videos, it appears uh, as though I'm doing like a service or putting out resources for people. But no, like I said, like when it comes to YouTube and Patreon, it's a five percent. Not doing enough for you guys. Like I'm put my I put myself up with um with like um Ross and 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 Ray Q Cynics, you know, they were doing live streams and putting out content like regularly and every day and and I'm gone for like months, you know. They're doing it daily and they're doing they're making books. They're they're doing um courses. They're expanding their business and all this stuff and it's like that's that's where I want to be, you know. I want to do that too. Maybe my own way, you know, because I can't, I can't replicate anybody, you know, no, everybody's different. And I just don't think I would be able to manage that kind of business-ish, maybe, I don't know, making excuses again. Um, but yeah, for myself, I'm, that's the thing, I, I'm always indulging too much, playing around too much. Yeah. 
Um, oh yeah, the ADHD thing. It's a hyper focus. It's hyper focus disorder. So when I focus, it's like it. Like I said, it's very polarized, and I get into the zone, and it just you get stuck. And so it's kind of a. I've talked about this before, but it's a predisposition of a lot of ADHD people, and that's why you think like the reason why we got so good at drawing is not because of any like inherent ability or talent or skill it's the the fact that we have this condition so if you had a superpower your superpower is to get stuck on something and not let it go so i can draw for i've done it before two days straight like not stopping uh, only to pee and drink and eat um straight and during school that was during my art school where i would always like try to cram everything and and do as much as i can for each class i mean i really push myself and um regularly on a regular basis i would draw eight hours straight and you tell that to somebody and they're like oh that's crazy like not really i don't i don't feel it because you're it's, it's stimulation during the whole entire the whole entire time it's kind of like meditating it's also like getting into the zone um, so if drawing for a long time is a struggle, then that's not that that's uh not a good sign. So when people was like oh, ask me if they're gonna be good at drawing, like how am I gonna you know, like they they have the potential or not, I just ask, well how how often do you draw and do you find yourself getting lost in your drawings? And if so, then. You can be a crap artist, but your potential is there. You're gonna, you're gonna just keep going, and you just gotta have faith in that, in that idea. Like, like I suck now, but I'm just gonna believe. I'm just believing that. So, How does having deadlines feel for you? They are a bit stressful, but personally, I enjoy them more. Um, deadlines? I used, I work well with deadlines. I do. Um, I, I have worked well. It's not always. Like, I, I procrastinate. There's been projects where I procrastinate like, like crazy, and then there's been projects where I just, like, nail it. I just freaking kill it, man. I'm talking about, like... 300 character char design for a video game, for example, you know. Um, and I worked on a game company doing that. And for school projects. Um, but lighter projects where I'm given more more leeway, I kind of take advantage of it. They say if you make, if you give someone a year to do something, they're going to take a year. If you give them a week, they're going to they're take a week. That's um, it's very true. Um, that sounds okay. Hair is kind of flat. If the light hits here, hits here again, hit here, hit here. I got no worry, no. Worry, no. Say I got no worries. You got no worries, bruh. You need to get some worries. Stress is stress is healthy. Yeah, that's actually true. Magic. It is. It's a little. You gotta have some a little stress. You don't have no stress, and you're just like laying on the street. You're, you're just gonna die. You need a little stress. That's what it's for. It's to motivate you to do something. Stop being so damn relaxed. And I'm very, very relaxed. I'm just, I'm just like, I'm good, man. It's terrible. Uh, you know, we're not getting any younger. 
Ah, freaking focus. Give him 100. Huh. Whoa. Yeah. You sound like a diamond. I got no worries. No. Uh, I'm going to change this. That's not a th anthem I like. That was nice, man. It's like, good for you, dude. You got no worries. I remember when I found your art years ago because of my friends. It's been four years now, and I'm always excited to see what you create. And the same can be said for a lot of people. Thank you. Thank you so much. See, that's the motivation right there. See? I, and that makes me feel guilty when I don't produce. Because I know you guys are keeping up with my stuff. And I'm like, four years? Couple months not doing anything. Not do something. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Mm. Nah, I ain't feeling this song. I'm very particular. You can't just be playing songs like that. You can't just be playing them. Uh, Katsi Katra, you did it again, huh? Does that mean? You just did it again. You don't it. You just keep getting rid of your messages. Huh. Let me see, if it was on the upper edge, would it be more light? And then less light? Oh, right. Yeah. Yeah, less light here. More light here. That makes sense. Catch, 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 catch. I want to actually listen to some known songs. I can sing and I know, but I can't. I get trouble. I get trouble. I lose all the monetization. Ah. Let's get some bigger shapes here. Bigger shapes here. Uh huh. There's that big old stomach over here that I'm like re reluctant to give it more light. I feel like it should have more light, but it's look it just looks cool with that little crescent on there. So we gotta decide how much light do we cover? More, 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 more. Huh? We get more. Let's keep going. All looks nice. Mm. 
we introduce more, we can do more. We introduce more, we do more. We introduce more, we do more. Elbow comes up, it will block some of the light. Catch her on the edge, edge, edge. And maybe a little bit of a knuckle. Because we're gonna define that shape a little bit. So it catches there. Not all of it. Just some of it. Maybe some of the glove. Oh, she has a glove, right? Does she? She have a glove? glove? Yeah. Some glove there. More light here. Yuffie, you got more light. You get more light. Then we get more light. If you get more light, we get more light. Let's give some light to his collar there. It's spilling over. The light's spilling over. Ah, ah, ah. So much light. Ah. It's no longer rim light, it's just like light, 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 light. Jibby, 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 Hainta Enang, Santo, Santo, up on, up on, a on, a Santo, a on, Santo. Lara Tainang, I cool. I let it cool. Some to, some to log on, so some to. I've been away, man. I know I've just been like gone and not like responding. <laughs> Sorry, bro. And you like, you reached out like maybe three, four times. Guys, check out Jibby, Jibby Fried Rice. That guy, I am no ordinary Super Sand. <laughs> Guys, go follow Jibby Fried Rice. One of the legends. Yes, it is a legend. He is a legend. And he's here right now. One and only. I'm not even joking. It's an incredible artist. Super, super incredible. Incredible artist, super friend, super brother. It's my little brother. It's my little brother, aka the fried rice. My little brother, my little uh, Cambodian brother. We're, we're not related, but we are because Cambodian, so that's what we is. That's what happens when you're Cambodian, you become related. Uh huh. I like this song. Yeah. Uh -huh. Bread, sub cynics. Speaking of the devil, what it does, cynics, I miss you too. You're Cambodian, yeah, Lazanda, Nyom Ku Kmai, Kanyom Ku Kmai, Kanyom Kmai, Bat, Bat, Nung Hai, Nung Hai, Nyom Ku Kmai, Na Kmai, Ain Ku Kmai, Kanyom, I don't, I'm not like, I'm not like. I'm not with it with that lingo, but don't be so kind. Yeah, we're Filipino. No, we're not. 
Mr. Cynix, what's up, Cynix? Cynix in design, give Cynix, hey, everybody, give Cynix a, no, nah, Cynix don't get it. Give Jibby a fried rice, a uh, fire, fire in the chat. Let's get some fires going. Now, nah, let's get some fires for everybody. Let's get some fires, guys. We got some all stars in the chat right now. We got the fam, some true fams, frams, the OGs, the OGs, the OGs from your knees. The OGs from your knees. Does that make sense? The OGs from your knees. The fuck? It's kind of nice, yeah. I just a minute. Just a minute. Just a minute. Just a minute. I just. Miss Mrs. NX. Cynics Designs, you guys. Check him out. He does YouTube sometimes. Sometimes he's on YouTube. But sometimes he's on Twitch. And most of the time, sometimes, he's in my heart. Oh my god, amazing. I'm um, Kuni. Kuni, is that Kuni? Kuni. No, Kuni. See, Kuni. Shout outs to Kuni. Is a true, true fam. He's fam. The Jetty's of Jetty Jet. Cooney here is a close friend from like childhood. My brother's one of my brother's bestest friends, and now he's like family because we like see each other during all family gatherings. Um, man, what you doing here? How's the convention scene going? Pretty good. Pretty good. We kind of took a break. This this has been like the longest break, and it's gonna pick up crazy after this one. So, we've been off of it for a good month, almost a month. Um, I was what one last two, three weeks ago, but then uh, we're gonna pick back up, and it's gonna be go go go. So like two shows a month, two to three shows a month. But what is <laughs> what is a boogie once? <laughs> Oh my god, this one's gonna make me blush. Who's this boogie monster? What are you doing here? What are you doing here? You never showed my shows. Who's that boogie monster? You like a little boogie. <laughs> hello, 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 fam. Hello, fans. What are you guys doing? My god, what are you guys doing? 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 Oh, what is this? What is this? This one's this. Hey, okay, good. I didn't merge it. Maybe we'll do that, and then maybe we'll do um this here. Something wrong with Sephiroth's eyeball. Ah, yeah, yeah. It's still weird. Yeah, it's still weird. Cause you can't tell what's his iris or eyeball, eye, eye, pupil, eye pupil. Can't figure out which what's what's what. Uh, sup? <laughs> awesome. Thank you, Hydro. Oh, first timer, first timer, guys. First time for Hydro. Give it up to Hydro 0228. Good looking out, Hydro. You here? Good, cause I'm gonna disappear after this this uh, month. I'm not gonna be back for a long time. Probably. I'm just saying. Probably. That's the case, cause I'm doing shows again, and I will disappear for another couple months, and I'll be back again. Uh, but we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll put another light source on the other side. And we're gonna make a color that we don't expect. Does you want to do it? Does you want to put it on here? Oh man, what are we gonna do? Cynics, Cynics, how you doing? Cooney, Cooney, Cooney Lunkel, Cooney Brad, how you doing? And how baby girl doing? How baby girl? I mean, Boogie Monster, little baby girl. I'm working, okay, I'm working, I'm working. See, I'm trying to work. I'm trying to do, I know, freaking 
freaking slacker. I'm just like, I'm sorry, 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 I'm sorry. <laughs> slacker. You guys, I'm a slacker. Don't give me any freaking leeway. I'm serious. Boogie Monster will tell you. What'd you do this week? Sleep? 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 And then two years pass by. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. It's true. It's cool. <laughs> we'll wait for you, Jetty. Have fun at you. We're gonna wait for me? You wait for me? Uh, I'll wait for you. We'll wait for each other. So if that's okay. I don't know if this color's gonna work. Let's try to dim it down a bit. Um, it's kind of nice there. Kind of nice there. Yeah, violet's nice. Violet's nice. Violet red is nice. <sighs> so we're gonna do another light source because we gotta pull out some of the shapes on the other side but we don't want to have it or orange otherwise it's like what are you doing on it what are you doing over here sun sunlight the sun a hey, sun i'm talking about sun solar 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 what are you doing here solar you are only one why you have two so we can't have the same color because sun is one singular solo solo the sun is solo that's why it's solar solar oh my god it's starting to make sense now cynics cynics are we gonna sleep at your house again Sleep at your house again. 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 No, I'm not gonna do that to you. I can't do that to you. I do that to you every single damn show. I'm sick and tired of this. Don't worry, man. We got a we got a buddy who uh, offered a place. I know you're getting replaced with another place. It's a buddy. No, he's a convention goer. We're uh, we're good buddies, and um, we do shows together often. Robot Cat, by the way. Robot Cat, check him out. Robot Cat's the guy we're spending with. Love Robot Cat. One of the best artists I know. Robot Cat. Robot Cat. Go check him out. Go give him a follow if you want. Ooh, a couple purchases, purchases, prints. Um, but he's offering up a place where we can stay with him. This convention. Um, but definitely want to see Cynics. If Cynics, you're going to be there. You're going to be at the show. You're going to be at the show. Cynics. Cynics. Cynics Designs, by the way, you guys go check out his YouTube page. He's got a YouTube. Like all time, big time. Big time. I was talking about Cynics. Uh, yeah, Cynics is one of the guys who set the standard, set the bar. Cynics Design, I said, I said, I told him, I said, I need to get on their level, your level, your level, Ross's level, Cynics level. Because I'm a bitch. I'm straight bitch. You know what I mean? And I don't want to be bitch. What is this song? I'm not feeling this song, by the way. Let me change the song. Vampire Fire? My god. He made a song called Vampire Fire. This is Epidemic Sound. Paid for a subscription. It's like $400 a month, and I actually. I was like, what the fuck? I purchased it using one account and I did it again on another account. Ah! <laughs> yeah, that's what happens when I don't pay attention. It becomes a problem. <laughs> you guys might think it's cute and funny because you guys don't have to deal with it, but no. It's a real issue. Trust me. Huh? Huh? Come on, you body. Come on, you body. Woo! What is this? 
All right. I don't know what this is. <laughs> so pop. Come on, you gotta do it at least four times. Mm -hmm. like, stop on me. Alright, let's turn this down. Tripping, man. Tripping. Come on, you body. Come on, you body. If you guys wanna get lunch tomorrow, we could. Tomorrow? <laughs> uh, I watched both you and Cynic Swim start drawing. Both rock. Yeah. Uh. Of course, as long as when you come back, you bring McDevils. Piano Cat. Ish cool. <laughs> Raise them donuts and make doubles. Cynics, they closed down Harry's. It was the saddest thing in the world. We went there and we're like, you know what? Cynics would love this right now. Freaking should have bought one for you and sent it to you. Harry's pancakes, best pancakes. And when you said that first time, I was like, it's it's okay. I wouldn't call it the best. But when we had it again and again, I think and again, <laughs> just to get our fill. Shit, they do it so good. It's moist and fluffy at the same time. It's like it's got like this bite. It's like this chew, almost like, almost like, almost like mochi. Maybe that's what they're doing. They're mixing rice into their pancakes. Damn. My God, it's rice pancakes. Harry's pancakes. <sighs> yeah, I'm gonna have to slow it down a bit here. Slow it down a bit here. Black bear pancakes, legit, really. Better than Harry's? Let me see if it's better than Harry's though. Because if it's better than Harry's, say less. We out. We out there. Paradise. Paradise. Oh, that's nice. Take me to your paradise. Take me to your paradise. Exactly where are these lights hitting? Does it make sense? Because I'm just like throwing it all over the place, not making any sense at all right now. Let's knock it back. Let's knock it back. Let's knock it back. Yeah, let's knock it back. Let's knock it back. Let's knock it back. Let's knock it back. This stuff right here doesn't make any sense at all. But you know what? We're gonna go back in there and put in some more. Tones and values. Oh, we gotta, we gotta add some lights to Tifa's boobies for sure. Um, 
You gotta make sure it's not so bright. Why is it so bright? Uh, you see? It's a problem with this color dodge here. You can't control exact values and stuff. You gotta kind of infer and then do like second hand guessing uh, what brightness level you're using. All right, I was feeling this on for a second, but it's like, mm, it's not quite, you know, it's not quite, it's too repetitive. And I just, better, better, you know my, he said, how dare you, how dare you. No, I'm gonna give it a shot. We gotta return black bear pancakes. I don't think you've had. I don't think you've had Harry's. You can't now because you're gone. Now you might have. You might have actually because from sack sack toe from the sack toes. Yeah. This Bread. Bread. Auto saving again. Wait, is it college dodge time? <laughs> it is. It's been color dodge time. Just saying, we've been we've been color dodging this whole entire time. This whole entire time from the very beginning of this this show, been color dodge. We've been streaming. Look, how long have we been streaming for? Hour and fifty minutes. Hour and fifty minutes color dodging. So you a little late. So it's been color dodge timing. We've been timing with color dodge. I'm sorry, I'm being mean. I'm being mean. I'm being mean. I'm being mean. Yes, it's color dodge time. It's color dodge time. Let's go. It's color dodge. Color doja. Color doja. Color doja. Um. This hair doesn't make any sense. This shape doesn't make any sense. Let's give some sense here. This arm, this hand doesn't make any sense. Let's make this not make sense. Um, I don't know what's going on back here. Oh, that's underneath the, okay, that's underneath the cape, okay. That's hair, that's supposed to be hair. That's supposed to be uh, the red, Fox dude's hair. So this would be a plane that's on top of it. Uh, and underneath it, we'll have to mm, knock out some of those those tones. Kiss you, my baby. Yeah. Huh? Come on, what layer is that on? What layer is that on? What layer is that on? Where is it on? What layer is it on? What layer is it on? This one? This one? This one? This one? This one? Ah, this one. Okay. 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 Mm, did I want to get rid of it? Okay. Sure. That don't look like a cape, by the way. I'm gonna figure it out later. Figure it later now. Now later. Ah. Too much layers obscuring other layers it makes it hard to pick up. Stop. Oh my god. <laughs> Too many layers! Uh, what is going on? I can't. I can't right now. I can't. I can't even. I just can't. I'm just gonna... It's gonna keep going. Sup? Help. What's up? What's going on? What's happening? Don't scare me like that with them caps. Whoa, PK, 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 familiar PK. Do we know? Do we know PK? PK, PK, 
PK? PK? Dare. Dare PK. I know PK. Ah, it's colors. There's no colors. There's no colors. There's only there's only tints and tones and hues. There's a hues. There are no colors. No local colors anyway. Random. John Scotson. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. No. New. 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 Um. Come on, boy. Come on, boy. So you. Come on, boy. Come. Come on, boy. That's why I say it monochromatic. Ah, did you say monochromatic? Wait, wait, where did you say that? Ah, oh, this. See, see, I saw coloring is on another level, but you said monochromatic. See, that's why you're ahead of me. See, you're ahead of me. You're on point. You already got. You already got. You already got the memo. <laughs> I'm over here lost as fuck. But thank you. You know what's up. You know what's up. It's just um, it's just um, it's not there yet. It's not there yet. It's not there yet. Honestly, it's really, really messy as hell right now. Still got a lot, lot, lot left to go. So. All right. So. What we can do next is, you know what we're gonna do next? We're gonna do. Look, we have it's one hour. It's almost two hours. Ah, uh, what the problemo? Okay, I know what's up. Mono equal one color. I know what's up. Yeah, you know what's up. Okay. You does. You does. You does. Okay. What we can do next? Yes, damn this a lot of these colors are just just like jumping all over the place by the way. They're like spotty and blah 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 no chill just blah 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 It's just like all over the place. Um and they're competing a lot so the direction is a little bit too chaotic for my personal preference. Yeah, this is really bright. I think that's kinda nice though. That means I need to punch it a little more. Punch it, punch it, punch it, punch it. Punch the rims on the left side. Kind of match the right a little bit. I mean, not too much, just just a little bit more. Why isn't it working? Huh. Yeah, it's a little chaotic. Let's kind of figure out where the lights hit. Here, 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 here. Kate sis. Back here. 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 Uh huh. Yeah. I'm going with a an ink, an ink, an ink brush. Just pulling out those forms from a distance so I can see what's going on. Hmm. I didn't even draw that gun really. I actually added that in the last thing I did. Just add the gun in. Up. 
Subtle, 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 subtle. 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 Except maybe not so subtle on Tifa. Because she's a cutie. Drawing is the next level. Arigatouzaimasu. Something random. <laughs> uh, blur on the edges, maybe? Try adding a blur on the edges, maybe? More focus. Blur, and maybe also a darker gradient for the background. We'll get we'll get there. It's all good points. Good points. Love the perspective. Thank you. Um, it's not quite perspective, but thank you. That is what is that? Oh, oh, oh yeah, yeah. Earth is boob. Earth boob. Gotta make sure we have those carved out. Defines her shape a little bit there. Okay. Oh, am I on the wrong layer? No. Oh yeah, yeah. Part of we go. Shit. That's why it's like getting a little extra bright. It was like doubling up. Okay. Pull that out and place it back on top of the correct color dodge. Uh, where's it at? Okay. And then we'll merge it down. Then we have it all in the correct one. Good. Um, then we can blend. Where's Boba? I don't know. Where's Boba? Uh, Boba, Boba. There's someone, someone a do doge of color. I don't even know what you're talking about right now. Oh, is this what you meant by blur edges? I was like, edges. We hit that, and we get the top of the glove, glove, and then also the arm, and then the top of here, which is the cape. And cape it, cape it, cape it, cape it. Right here. Mm. I think that's pretty much it for the lighting. We don't listen when we talk. That's true. Cause you talk, and I can listen. Um, 
It's so and so. It's it's a. You just like got rid of it, didn't you? Get rid of your comments. You get rid of your comments. Hmm. This one right here. Not blue. Okay. We're going to take this. Carve out these shapes here a bit. Okay, 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 go down. I flipped the picture and I'm like not feeling like it should be so... So equal to the left side's light. What is your favorite anime? You didn't like it. That's cool. I love Studio Trigger. My favorite anime is uh, Scissor 7, by the way. You guys watch that. It's my favorite. How many hours do you draw in a day? Man, like 35 in one day. Every day I draw like 35 hours. It's crazy. Every day. I go, oh, gotta add in those extra six hours. Put them in. Get them down. so shiny might not make it too shiny it's too distracting it's too distracting it's too distracting it's too So 
Too bright, too bright about see it loses intensity. How's that light light just jumps at you? You don't want that. It loses its intensity as we get lower in the picture. Because light is is stronger from the source. Gradually decreasing intensity. Also, my brother was trying to get get sleep. 35 hours. That's all. All you need. Squ oh, zoom out and squint, bro. Bro, PK. Who's PK? Maybe Tifa's lay is burning too much. I'm not sure what's going on here, man. PK. You wanna you wanna draw for me real quick? You wanna just like take over? <laughs> Take over. It's like the things that I want I have in my mind. Like you, you, you get it, you get it, you get it. Those are some valid points. I just I haven't gotten to it yet. I'm like doing one thing right now. Um, but maybe you are talking the the thing that I'm working on. I just don't realize it. Something. Uh, 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 uh. Maybe he's playing too much. You mean like the the back line? Yeah, I got rid of that line because um, got rid of it because um, I. Enlarged her leg, I moved her leg, and so I raised the line. So it's just a rough draft line. I'm gonna go back in there and add in these lines and forms, etc. Et 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 um, so yeah, going to have to make the highlight on clouds arm much brighter though yeah let's go really really bright well not super super bright but enough to catch the foreground Sorry, no, no, no. No, no, I appreciate it though, I really do. You're freaking engaging and you don't have to. Like, you don't even have to be here, but you're watching and I really appreciate that. Um, and I love, I love critiques for sure. Um, but when you're like guiding me, it becomes like, my brain's like focused on one thing. It's like, hold on a sec. Hold on a sec. You know? I get like... And that's one thing I get very like caught up in comments not because i don't like it but because if it if you make a comment it's valid and i need to check it like i need to check it but you know so i get little caught up on them and be like oh crap now i gotta do something about it because something's wrong right and it'll bug me so i try to stay away from that kind of comment unless it's like something i'm actively directly working on you know um, uh, yeah, it's, well, it's very, very welcome for comments and etc. Um, it sounds too slow, and it's too sad. I don't know. Uh, no, you're not critiquing. I know, I know. You're not critiquing. You're, you're literally just tr trying to guide me. <laughs> You're guiding. Mm -hmm. 
What is this song? I might not control what might happen. <laughs> How did you come with all of the puzzles placed, Mr. Lover? Well, it started a long, long time ago, about pretty much two two years ago. We worked on this um, individually, and it just evolved from there. No, it didn't evolve from there. I actually had another drawing before that. The original drawing was actually different, completely. I did three different versions, actually. Uh, Google. I didn't Google. Yeah, I was working on see, just like building up different, different versions of the story. Um, but there was one way before that, and that was the one that I did on the plane back from New York, I think. And it was a. Uh, it was the one that really like ended up going with. So my initial sketch was on the iPad. Uh, I don't have it anymore, really. I just I grew I I think I built off built built uh, built off of it. It took you two years to make. No, two years ago is when I started it. Yeah, um, and I only recently picked it back up this last week. Crazy. No. Crazy. Do 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 crazy. It's the kind of music you get from like free music. Chotta ma de tsugi. Next thing we do, I thought I was going to do this off the air, and I probably should, but we'll do it, we'll do, uh, we'll do part of it, because it's going to take a long, long time, so I'll pause my recording. This can take up another three, four hours to do. Three hours, maybe? Two to three hours to, to do this next section. <gasps> I wasn't recording at all this whole time. You probably got down at least 14 years to master all of this. Mm, probably 14 years about yeah I've been drawing for quite a bit <laughs> oh yeah Calling it right now, dope. Uh, that's dope. I feel weird about using old stuff, but it's a sketch. It makes sense. Hmm. Well, if you look at, um, I tend to have a lot of old drawings. I have, I have drawings that I want to finish from two years, three years ago. I have like over a hundred drawings that I've, I've done. Not over, maybe like sixty, six years so. 60s drawings that I need to done that I need to complete and by this anime expo this year so I'm going to anime expo you guys um and I was telling people I wanted to finish like 20 of them I was like I'm gonna do 20 I'm gonna do 20 I'm gonna be crazy and just do all these drawings it didn't work out hello what's up nice work thank you thank you Thank you. Capcun, Capcun crap. Swaddy, swaddy crap. Swaddy crap. Swaddy crap. Hold up, four years. <laughs>
สวัสดีสวัสดี what I'm not finishing drawings โอวาระยาฮิอาโอยอาโออาอาโออุยอาโออุย What's up You're back Welcome back Welcome back <laughs> He finishes what he finishes Finishes what he finishes Mm -hmm. So now I have all these crazy ass colors and lights and shapes. I'm gonna start pulling out these shapes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hush. Music, music song. This is gone. Play some music. Some music. Ah, uh, music. I guess that's it for the K-pop. They don't have much K-pop on here then, and it's like, it's okay. It's okay. All right, I have a small playlist from the ones that I liked, and once that ends, I will stop. So there's like, like 10 songs or something. Completed a number of pieces in the past four years. He's huh? Who? What brushes are you using? Don't ask. <laughs> it's not the brush that makes the artist. Yeah, it is. <laughs> yeah, it is. It's all the brushes. Go check my Gumroad store. That's where I. That's how you get become good at drawing. You need to buy brushes. I completely advocate brushes. So go get as many brushes you can. I offer all these brushes in my store. That's the secret to being good. Just saying. Put it out there for the record. How you do it? And if it doesn't make you better, at least you get like some cool brushes. You get like a, an advantage over people who don't have brushes because you're like, <laughs> if you're gonna make shitty drawings, at least you're using good brushes to do it with. <laughs> and then you can. Show off. I have a Doja brush, and I'm godlike. Yeah, see. So I was trying to tell him. I'm getting tired. I'm not tired in drawing. I'm kind of tired in talking because I talk a lot. coming out of his arm so big it's like, vein check they say my life is golden what about them golden vein check that's about them about them golden
It's hard to find any of these layers. Keep having to turn off these layers because they're like blending into each other. Okay. Now I gotta go back to turn the mic on. <laughs> we be vibing. All right. Thank you. Thank you. We just vibing. We are here. Thank you. this recording and start recording again I have I been out here fighting for my life Yeah, this is just a um, instrumental track. I liked it. Pose is nice on oh, God. Are you gonna go four days? Am I gonna be on? Yeah. Ah, the bane of the year. Thank you. I'm gonna be on all four days. Zero. Yeah, I'm gonna be there all four days. Are you gonna be there all four days? If you know, let me know. Come true. So I thought you knew. 
Boop, boop. Hey, boo boo. What's truly a blast watching your porn action? Hey, babe. I'm just. I'm just winging it, man. Just winging it out here. I'm just trying not to get fined. I'm just out here so I don't get fined. That's my rule. Oh, I got all these layers open. What the hell? Turn off. Huh? Auto saving again. Justin Paul. Justin Paul. Peace. Look. Thank you. Thank you. Me watching you draw is involved me too. Me drawing, and now my girlfriend is drawing. Good. Then the dog's gonna draw, and then your grandma's gonna draw, and the fish is gonna draw, and then and then you're gonna start YouTube page, and then we're all gonna draw. We just all draw. It's a good time. Sketch with me. I'm happy. I'm happy. I'm happy. I'm happy. I'm glad, glad I can help inspire you to draw. Because then we can participate together. And then we can improve together slowly. Justin Paul. This way. No problem. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's a weird chip too. Let's go like this. That strap attaches to something, I don't know. Something.
it's like completely like offset it's like he's wearing like goes over here and then this one's over here we just try to do it like this oh that's what we started the show off with I keep turning off these layers so I can see <laughs> the one that it's I'm looking for. Turn off my rough draft lines and I can still kind of see the shapes. That's when you know you're like getting closer towards where you want it to be. Matter of fact, I'm gonna lower the bright the value of the passive even more. Well, are you gonna Justin uh, it's Justin Justin we go to conventions together Justin do you do the uh, the, the robots similar to Iron Giant just wondering sorry if I forgot but uh, Justin wait are you from Canada you do you do Zelda you draw Zelda Justin sorry up. What made me move to Clip Studio? Well, it was when I first discovered the way it um, it had line stabilization to the uh, to the tool, so you can feel how the lines feel different and slightly look different. Um, it's already been like 10, 15 years, and you and Photoshop still has. I, I don't know. Well, I I do use I do have Photoshop as well, uh, but it does not feel right. Uh, but it's capable of doing so many other things. But, um, I invested in Clip Studio when it was like called Manga Studio. These shapes, what are those shapes? What are the shapes? The design. Let's go like this. I guess it does. It does now.
I don't want this song to get old. I shouldn't be playing it over and over. City. I'm not actually. I don't think. <sighs> Sorry if I'm whispering and my voice is tired. I'm very tired actually. I'm not tired. My voice is. Just simple, yeah, that's right. I, I, I remember now. Zelda, you do the Zeldas. Yeah. down a bit so I'm just gonna like talk right here talk right here and let me turn on the music a little bit so I don't have to like yell and then drink some tea Got tea <gasps> I have tea <sighs> two two hours and 43 minutes I told you guys it's gonna take another three hours and you guys disappeared. Three hours more and you're like, mm-mm. Yada eat it. Yada. Oh, 
By the way, this is like I've heard this song maybe twice now, so I'm trying to might as well just learn it with you guys. gonna like cut off this leg anyway I'm gonna worry about these legs for I don't know I'm bad for a tilt cons after two years of nothing then coming back to so many is a bit interesting yeah we're doing it we're doing it Yeah, let's go check out Justin Paul. He's a con buddy. We do conventions together. Check him out. Justin, Justin, what's your Instagram? What's your Instagram, Justin? Um, I'm heading to bed now. It's late on my side of the earth. Oh, your sun, your moon is my sun. It's late for you, so you need to go to sleep. It's time for bed. Psst, magic rain. It's time for bed. Time to go to sleep. Good night. Good night. I should get off too. I should get off soon. I'm just gonna probably go exercise. 11:15. My God, I'm working. I'm working. Putting in that work. 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 Oh, rain. Oh yeah, rain. But you magic though. If you're magic, then I have to call you magic. But if you don't have any magic, then I, I guess not. But I think you're magic. I just wanna be with you, pal. This singer right here is crazy. He's on the Epic Epidemic Sounds. Epidemic Sounds is the like paid license music you use for production and stuff. So you pay for the subscription and then you can use all their the library of their music for a period of time. And it links to whatever social you have and you won't be flagged by that participating platform like YouTube. So but this guy is awesome. He's so cool. What's his name? I'm I'm in. Yeah, shout outs to I'm in. Shout out to I in. Thank you for providing these great tracks. But I get bored of songs quite fast, so I need constant like new, 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 new. Like I'll only listen to a song like three or four times because I'll have like a playlist of like a couple hundred every month and then I'll play it on random and I gotta go what's the next month uh -huh. um, 
And right now I'm just listening to the uh, favorited songs from what I've heard so far, which is not very many. It's like seven or eight. Yeah, as you can see, this just keeps going and going and going and going. So I'm gonna make my streams a little, a little bit, a little bit shorter next time. Like, oh, we'll set like a time limit. Um, maybe an hour thirty. I think that's a good amount of mark. It's, you know what I mean? It doesn't drag on. Capture some of the high moments, but then we gotta leave it on a high note. So I'm not like super tired. It's like. That's a little crooked. Yeah, it's a little crooked. A lot of crooked, actually. my own music so bad Unlike <laughs> this song, it's kind of, it's kind of dumb. But this is the last song, and so it'll be it. And oh yeah, as you guys know, I said I would sing last time, but I can't because YouTube demonetizes me. So I ruin all the fun. Can't sing anymore. I want to though.
Uh, but we might do it on. We'll do it on. We'll do it on Twitch when I get on Twitch again. Girl, you cold blooded. That was it. All the songs I got in this playlist, anyway. You guys are all asleep. All asleep. Good. Good. We'll talk to you later. Gotta work on his face a little bit, it's a little, it's a little weird. It's still a little weird, eyes are a little weird, everything's kinda weird. Yeah, eyes are way off. Uh. Mm -hmm. Yep, eyes are off. One there, flip it, one there, okay. Chin's not lined up right. Uh, you're up. You're up. Hey, Dom Sept, Dom Sept Art, Dom Sept Art. Nice to see you're up still. It's good. Good, 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 good. Take this part out. Take these lines out. Drop this line out. Right in and out. Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. Can't erase that because it's hidden underneath so many layers. Oh, I got it. The best way to do it probably is just to go over it, uh, go over uh, the top layer and just render it out like a one flat layer and just paint where I have, but then that would mean flattening it. It's not kimchi, it's cute. Dumb set, dumb set dart. It's a kit. I like it. It's clever. Look at my name, the Jetty Jesho. That's that's cringe. The Jetty Jesho. Which 
And I said, you're a chew or show? Are you a show? Kinda. Hey, your lips are girly. Hey, girly. What's going on? Because I'm on the wrong layer. I'm just like, ugh. I should turn off all the color dodge layer and stuff. I love how you got your drawing skills. Thank you. Thank you, Black Guys. Look at your avatar. Is that fun? Also, five red is That's crazy. Crazy. Yeah. Is that this one? Yeah. What are the odds? Mm. I'm here, 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 here. Oh, uh -huh. maybe just turn the music back on. It's the problem. I forget to breathe sometimes. I'm not like, you know, that what you start drawing like, Bush. you're thinking too much. Bush. Just square out his jaw a little bit. Try to make him slightly manlier. He's very boy girly right now. Or not girly, feminine. Feminine. JT is back again. <laughs> We're back at it again. Oh, let's go. <laughs> Thank you. I can feel your hype. I can feel your hype. I can feel your hype. Um, we can try to browse around, put some pop music on. Let's see what kind of pop music we got. I said I'd be done, but this is what happens. We back at it again. I really want to bring in the hype, but can't. Not with my voice. But yeah, we've drawn. We've been drawing for quite a while now, so I should definitely rest my eyes. I'm like looking down for four hours straight, three hours. Oh, 
my Slayer again. What is going on? This seems a little messy. What the hell? Oh, I have like this layer on. What the heck? Go away. Label one of these highlight. Let's label this one lines. Lines. Ambient occlusion lines. Lights. What's this one? Nothing on this one. Delete this one. Uh. I just want to see before I get off some highlights. Some strong highlights because I'm getting too excited, too twitchy, too too excited. I want to see some highlights here. Right there. Sparkly eyes. There's a little too much of those highlights here. JT back at it again. Let's go. I'm losing that anime feel. I'm starting to render, render too much. Ah, stop. Stop. Keep it subtle. Keep it subtle. Keep it subtle. Keep it subtle. Tifa, blam blam blam, blam blam blam. I love Tifa. Tifa. Yes, I love Tifa. She's completely like not rendered or flushed out or anything right now. 
So please give her some time. I'm not still working on this over here. Working on a little bit of Cloud's face. Male characters, most anime are naturally more effeminate, so didn't notice. Yeah, male, yeah, they tech tend, tend to be. You're right about that. I noticed they're hella boy, like girlish, girly, like they're like boyish, boyish when they're like young, feminine looking, <laughs> like pop stars, pop, K-pop, J-pop. They got that. But I think anime and video games are kind of a separate genre. Like anime, I mean, video games tend to go lean more towards, well, no, there's just a wide variety, obviously. Yeah, they, they blend, they blend. They blend. have a you can have video games that are anime based you know like or a game completely not anime like yakuza that's what i'm saying like yakuza or dead or alive the video fighting game yakuza the well yeah yakuza game it's um it's japanese completely but it's very real realistic Trying to create some more graphic shapes mixed in, not completely rendered, rounded forms, so flat shadows, flat lights, because it looks more, mm, more appealing, in my opinion. Graphic sense it just catches your eye. When you're too literal and make things too realistic, like. Uh, you don't really oh yeah bad on just gonna stay here work on his face forever and ever and ever thank you thank you side 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 that looks butters butters ninja bro you've been ufo out of here out of what? yeah we talked about this i got ufo'd bro I had like a UFO dream one time. Not recently, like years ago, but. <laughs> yeah, I got abducted. <sighs> but I'm back. They brought me back, luckily. So, we're good. Um. What is this all about? What the hell? It's too bright. I'll like pull back and like see things and then just like come in and like. Uh. But Cloud's looking pretty tight so far. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh shoot. Uh, yeah, it's going on for quite a bit this, sh this episode, so. I don't want to borrow you guys too much. We're gonna. Call it a night. It's 11.42. Okay, I will catch you guys later. later. I'll just put pop music on, I guess. This is the pop genre. Epidemics. Um. Alright, so that's what we got so far, but... I can't handle ninja. <laughs> can't handle ninja. <laughs> oh, yes they can. Yes they can. Like I had an abduction dream. Like I don't think I was abducted. It felt damn real, but it was like a nightmare, you know. And you feel I felt paralyzed and I was like in like a contain a contain this is some spooky stuff. In a contain 
like a containment place where it had other people all contained in rows of people like almost like body bags but like standing upright and I woke up in the middle of that so kind of like <laughs> good luck see <laughs> Justin <laughs> kind of like almost like um oh yeah thanks for thanks for dropping by Justin um, almost like like matrix just like scary as fuck when you get taken <laughs> and this happened like 2013 14 something like that and then like i won't get into details but they did something in that moment that they did that thing i like shocked out of it i was like holy shit. it was like zoomed right back into my body like no get me out of here yeah Thank you, Domsum Doncept Art. Thank you so much. So, um, yeah, this is uh, this is going to be hopefully finished by Anime Expo, and um, hope you guys are going to be able to go out there and visit us. Come check us out. Ax I seven is my table in L A. Um. No sneak peek of what I also have in store. I didn't show you guys. I kind of did last time, but it is also something I finished. Yeah, but it's a secret. Don't tell anybody. We'll uh, we'll see you guys there. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, oh, I will end the stream now. Saving. Um. I'll see how far I get with this. Hopefully I can... I tend to work a lot faster off the camera, like off the air. Obviously I'm not talking to... I'm not talking 24, don't tell nobody. Don't tell anybody 24. <laughs> hey. And uh, thanks everybody for joining the stream. There's so many of you guys um, who participated and commented, please... Uh, uh, don't forget to like and subscribe and all that stuff and leave some comments if you guys are watching this at a later time and you made it this far i really can i really commend you congratulate you because it's a long it's a long it's a long stream it just like goes on and on and on so appreciate you guys for dropping by and um well hopefully i'll catch you guys again soon maybe on twitch next next time so we'll see <laughs> yeah we're about, shh, yeah don't tell nobody but don't tell nobody okay so yeah i think we made some progress we made some progress today all right good stream good stream uh i got the same us and as always i like to say mm, up Ba-da-ba-ba-ba-boom. Pieces.